Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's work on the problem 20 by chapter 4. In this one, um, it gives us a very new scientific um, idea about optic tweezers. But it is just a laser act on the particle and then makes the act makes the, there is a force acting on the particle. The look at the applying a force on the particle and make the uh, this particle can live it. We can understand it this way. But then this force is given, right? So we can say the force is given. This force is because optics, so we write it there. And then we can say this force equals the mass times acceleration. No problem because for particles, because it's small, small, super small, we don't consider the gravity. And in this one. This is a MA and ask you to estimate it is acceleration. So in G's, so this G is acceleration due to gravity. Do you agree? So acceleration due to gravity, A divided by G is just as a force divided by mass. Because if we, we want to find the ratio A divided by G, we times mass there, we times mass there. And then we can say MA is a force optics. This force is just uh, because the uh, optics, and then this mg is just a uh, gravity. In this one, a divided by g just equals the force by optic divided by the uh, gravity. And then next one, can you find the uh, gravity by the particles? Sure, because the gravity, we can see the gravity is mass times the g. The mass is the uh, density times the volumes. So volumes for a particle. Is, is this one. You can look at the mass handbooks. The volumes for a particle is just uh, this one. So then you get the gravity for the particles. And this uh, force by the objects is given. It is there. Therefore, mu newtons. And therefore, you are done. Thank you.